All right, the NES Classic Edition was released on Friday. That was the 11th. I went to GameStop, Walmart, Target, and Toys R Us. They were sold out. So I went out today, Sunday the 13th. By the time you watch this video, it's going to be like past midnight, so it's going to be on a Monday. But I went out today, three different GameStops, all sold out. I asked the cashier when they're expecting more, and she said next month, uh, right before Christmas. So I went ahead, went on eBay. Look at the prices for these things. This auction just ended, $178. It's probably more because uh, I had this up when the auction was still going. Well, let's let's take a look at more here. Uh, Four thousand dollars. I guess they're hoping someone uh, goes crazy and pays that much. But let, let's look at actual auctions. Okay, this is uh, this guy has three of them. You know, it's kind of a douchey move, but you know what? Capitalism, man. And I know it's all these GameStop nerds, all these GameStop nerd employees. I don't think anyone actually got to buy them. I'm pretty sure it's GameStop employees who are snapping them all up and selling them on eBay. But hey, I'm sure GameStop doesn't pay that great of a wage. So if it's helping you guys make money, you know, take advantage of the rich nerds out there. I don't need to pay $200. Uh, 300 free shipping. I don't know if anyone's going to buy that. That's buy it now, $200. Um, $190. 190 it's going to end in a minute 300 so it looks like about 200 is the going the going price 230 is trying to get 230 okay 192 these are pe these are auctions people are actually bidding on so it looks like the going rate is $200 not bad not bad considering they're like $60 brand new and the thing with uh the NES classic edition is uh it comes with 30 games built in. It's like a mini NES. It fits in the palm of your hand. And it comes with one controller. Good job, Nintendo. Include one controller so you could sell the other one. This guy's trying to sell the controller for $69. But uh, 30 games built in. Really good games. And I was going to pick it up because there's a few games on it that I don't have. Like Ninja Gaiden, Gradius. Uh, I, I actually don't have Super Mario Bros. 3 right now. So I was going to pick it up on launch day. I like to support the gaming industry. And I like buying things on launch day when it's actually something I really want. You know, support the hard workers, making products I like. Yeah, this is crazy, man. So 200 bucks. So uh, there you go. This one's 217 So that's a hell of a profit, man. And the people paying for this, you got some rich nerds out there who, who really want an NES Classic Edition. I wonder if it's going to be a collector's item, though. How many is Nintendo going to make? That's the question. Are they going to make a lot, or is this going to be extremely limited? Personally, I'm not aching to get one. If I never find one for $60, I'm not buying it. I'm not paying freaking $200 for this. 99 or best offer. Oh, empty box. Nice trying to fool people i i hate that i i hate the loopholes like ebay nerds freaking try to use okay so let's see what this ended up going for so i had this up before i made this video so it ended up selling for 193 yeah so 200 is a going rate all right so if you see this if you're out at the store and you actually see this pick it up because they're going for like 200 so if you're lucky enough to find one get it buy it I mean, if I find it, I'm actually going to keep it because I actually want one. But if you want to make a quick $140, sell it on eBay. Good job, GameStop cashiers. Good job picking them up and, uh, you know, making some money. It, hopefully you guys have a kick-ass Christmas. Is it like this in the UK, too, if you're subscribed to my channel and you live somewhere else? Are they sold out everywhere because... The United States, it, look, it appears they're all sold out. All right, everyone, kick ass. Be safe. Take it easy. Have a great and safe week.